Quinto. This time with a size advantage on Alolino. Quinto turns around. Nice pass to Hodge with a reverse. Easy for him to just develop things and get things going, most especially to get his teammates involved under the basket. Coach John Adele Cardell calls that timeout. It's 18 to 14. Especially that now he's he's a dad, you know. You know yeah. that he has a newborn baby, and it, that really inspires him a lot. Yeah, you know, uh, it's on Mother's Day, not Father's Day, so we can't really <laughs> treat Robert anything. Receiving end of some extra contact. Let's see here. Oh, just a nudge there, and I think uh, just got hit right at the sternum. All right. That's why they kind of lost a couple of games to start the conference. Wala tung mga to, you know. Usually they're they're the ones who guard the big guys. Let's take a look at this one more time. Great uh, roll here by Bates. A beautiful pass by Bonquito. Inside the shaded area for Miranto. Four free throws for the San Miguel Beermen to level the score. Quinto on the attack. That short jumper trickles in. And you should see this as a great sign for the sure. offense of Miranto because they are getting into that paint. It's doubled. Hodge driving. Quinto, three seconds on the shot clock. Oh, oh gets the floater and the an drop. Change of baskets between these two ball clubs. To take the lead, but Hodge, last second, gets into Quinto, who just fires a prayer over Jude Marfajardo and gets it answered as Berago takes a one point lead back from the Beerman. Well, that's the best av available shot that you have. One of the smallest players, the shortest players, to score 30 points in a PBA game. Now we saw that. I covered that game actually, yeah. and it was a. Anjo issues a pass out to Torres. Norbert to Bonquito. Three point shot is knocked down. It's coming from Christian Stan Hardinger. Meanwhile, the three point counter. Bea Escudero as Stan Hardinger grabs another rebound. That mm. pass stolen. As Hodge and Norbert Torres both tied for it. Quinto on the drive. The layup oh, is wow. good off the bank. Parang they're baiting him to shoot that three. No? Banquero. Okay, it's Quinto. Three-point shot. Second try. Now it's a make. Looks like that will be his role moving forward. It will be Almazan whistled with it. And going back to that zone defense, so the commitment was not 100% coming from the defense against Quinto. Yep. They're going to find themselves open. He needs to be the aggressive Scotty Thompson here in order for Barca Nebra to have a chance in this ball game. Well, you know, even if he doesn't score as much, he's another guy who would love to post up. This is so comfortable for Bong Quinto. Take a look at this. And that's not a small guy he's posting up in Mava and Misi, but Bong Quinto. And Misi. There they go. Back to Stan Hardinger against Hodge. Oh, nice steal by Quinto. Bon Quinto all alone. Lays it up and in. Left. Emergency pass. They find the corner and sees over three. Won't work. Almazan taps it over to Bon Quinto. Karam is ahead. Anjo is gone. Now that's the right guy to find in a fast break. Anjo Karam. Look for him giving him that uh, long pass. Oh, that's a good response coming from Bon Quinto, posting up C.J. Perez, who will commit second. second. Yes. But C.J. Perez also was in foul trouble. So you can see, you know, Morocco's really good at really identifying where they feel they have the advantage. That's why they can... Against Norbert Torres, but what a big three coming from Bon Quinto. This guy likes this matchup for sure. Quinto. Quinto. Five straight points for the Morocco Bolts. Five seconds of shot clock. Let's keep to know it. Falling away. He gets the drop at the last minute. Lost for words uh, with that move from Calvin Octana. And of course, that's a big, big basket for TNT. Layup and one for Bonquito. So they will stay in this game. They will stay within striking distance because there's 36.3 seconds yes. left. So smart uh, from uh, Bonquinto to attack immediately. That's a, that's just a big time play. Coming. Back up to four. Barca North Court. Oh! Big slam there from Bong Quinto. As Richard Ferro, after that report, misses the three point play opportunity. Oh, yeah. Doesn't make the free throw. Quinto attacking. Look at that. Beautiful wow. pass by Bong Quinto. Fajardo, good position against Bates. 
but double team and stopped by Hodge. Here comes Quinto, turning on the Jets. Quinto all the way to the cup for two. Minute gone here in quarter number two. Dario. As close to launching, here is Quinto. Falling away, money. With three and CJ Perez with only two. Here's Bon Quinto, finding Raymond Almazan inside. That's you don't want uh, you know Wami to just take off any any time in the game because he definitely can just slide it up. Raymond Almazan scoring down low once again. Playmaking here, hands it off to Bon Quinto, who's going to test the newly inserted Nino Valdez Quinto. Gets him up in the air, oh. and that's a tough shot. So far, Bon Quinto has got the numbers of Valdez. It's like an off-balance shot there by De La Rosa. Ooh, Quinto falling down, finishes the basket. Actually, that was also an off-balance shot, but fortunately, he was able to make that shot and a foul. His first point since last game. <laughs> Take a look at this. Against Laput and Trotter falling down. Good pass, Brondial with a fake. Oh, he's met by the defense on the help coming from Pasquale. What, what a tight pass. pass as Quinto wow. lays it up and in. Absolutely threaded the needle. What a pass to Quinto. Was one of the points of improvement coming from Meralco heading into this ball game. They need to start running again. And when you have an ace playmaker like Chris, Quinto for three. Oh, oh look Bates at the way to the he offensive board. The Jumar. And oh. Quinto gets Fajardo to bite on the fake, gets the basket plus the foul. They're giving him that ball of, on that corner shot. And look at the way they feed him that basketball after. Remember the first time that Ray Suerte was activated by Blackwater? He immediately showed that he was someone who could help. And Bon Quinto. That's something that he would want to do. Look, look at this. On the dribble, attacks the defense of Big Game James. It was a little too wide right there, the driving lane. Well, nine minutes and they're down by 11 points. Still, more than enough as Baranga Ginebra is also struggling with their turnovers. Volquito will slam it home. One of the things that uh, Miralco needs at this point, no, yung kanyang uh, driving to the basket and even his outside and shot. Hardinger grabs another rebound. That mm. pass stolen as Hodge and Norbert Torres both tied for it. Quinto. On the drive, the layup oh, wow. is good off the bank. But first, look at this play coming from Bong Quinto. Defense setting up, beats him with a Euro step. Sneaks that. Anything below that, it's tough as Hodge misses. Quinto reclaims the possession. He attacks wow. quickly and he gets the N1 opportunity. On the drive and getting a foul for an N1 from Scotty Thompson. Doesn't go, battle for the rebound. Hodge ends up with it. Usab thought about it. Quinto lines up the three. That oh. is good. Bon Quinto with a triple. Against Japet. Drive inside. What a pass. Banquero for three. Oh. What a play by Bon Quinto. Take a look at this pass by Quinto. Oh, no look pass. Beautiful. And Chris, Chris Manquero and Bonquito to recognize the shot clock winding down. Yes. And Ciso gets the step. Simon. Oh, hesitant. And now Bonquito is ahead. Quinto slam oh. it home. Oh. Malco, here's that last pass coming from Yusuf uh, and Quinto made sure about that. CJ Perez with a business decision not to commit his fifth personal foul. Not challenging Quinto, who will sky high for the slam. Dunk Meralco bolts up by four. Timeout. And we get back to live action with the San Miguel Beerman getting another crack at it. Marcio loses the basketball to Bon Quinto, and they're on the run again. A chance to take the lead. Quinto sets it up. Banquero touchdown, and he was fouled. It's a two possession ball game here. They need to get a stop. Meralco have been destroying. The Rangers on last pins on the offensive end, and Norbert Torres gets an easy two. Won't drop on Mubere with an offensive board, but passes it to Quinto. Quinto on the break, stops, pops, and hits once again. He's got two baskets in the contest. 
probably the best rebounding guard, if you want to call him that, here at the PBA. Oh, yes. Oh, well, you know, you have Scotty Thompson That's right. to, uh, That's right. to contest that for sure. That's not going to be easy yeah. to, you know, to challenge. Here's Ancho Cara, Becerame right in front of him. Zinok Valdez trying to work on Bong Quinto. Quinto, wow. the spin inside. Wow. What a move from Bong Quinto. Again. Their move early here in the fourth quarter. And Quinto posting up. Balanza, nice pass inside. Almazan oh. with a slam. <laughs> CJ thought he could have been fouled there. Quinto for three. That's Whoa. good. Great defensive effort by Morocco to foil that attempt by CJ Perez. And they come back this way. And there is Kier Quinto dropping it like it's hot from three point land. And he gives his team. And a lot of uh, minutes already incurred by uh, Drayden Bata. Hey, that's another turnover right there. Almost a counter steal by Blackwater. Malik C from downtown. Banquero on the drive, kicks it out to Quinto. Bong with five to work with. Quinto trying to find space. Turn it out, jumper. Oh, rims it. Missed it. Counting Wami Johnson here. Almost a turnover. Yes, it is. And there's CB going all the way to the cup for two. And Maralco were able to really stop that play. And here is there you go. Oh, Quinto. Huge possession. Over to Hodge. Now Quinto open for three from the corner. Oh, He's big. got it. That's big. Terra Firma played the interior so well. Now the Chris Newsom finding Bong Quinto, showing a double team here. Great find inside to Cliff Hodge, and Cliff Hodge up to scoring tallow to 14. 